Hey, what is up guys? I'm back here once again, and I'm going to be trying to do something a little bit different today. So, I was thinking on what kind of survival series I could do that I haven't done already, because I've done, I would say, almost every survival series uh, that you can think of. Almost. Uh, obviously, there's some things that I haven't done, but, um, yeah, so I was looking on what I could do, and then I remembered that a while ago they came out with this, um... With this little chat, I guess it's a chat, I don't know. I mean, I would consider it a challenge, but pretty much you start out in a one by one um, area, and there's a border around you, and when you do certain objectives, the border gets larger, and then you can do other things. And um, yeah, so this series is going to um, take the place of crazy craft because that mod pack is in my opinion that mod pack is uh not the not the really something i uh i feel like playing um it lags i mean i say i would say i have a pretty decent computer and it 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 lags a lot and yeah i don't know i just don't really feel like doing it well i'm going to be continuing uh sky factory with trevor but i'm not going to be continuing uh, crazy craft I apologize but yeah I'm going to be continuing this I don't know I kind of prefer doing survival series over modded anyway but the sky factory mod pack is really fun so if you guys haven't checked that out um, you guys can there's a playlist on my channel with all the episodes in it so yeah this uh, little map I'm gonna be doing is called captive minecraft and I'm gonna I'm going to read this little uh, thing here, so you guys can get the gist of what this is. Captive Minecraft is a new survival game. Uh, this came out two years ago, so it's not really new anymore. A new, sur new survival game type that traps you in a world border, an impending wall which prevents you from exploring the world surrounding you. When you first begin, the space you have available is quite limited. You can't move further than the block you spawn on. However, for Minecraft to for each Minecraft achievement you learn, or earn, your world border increases in each direction by one block. As your captive world slowly expands, you gain access to new resources, special areas, and rewards. So that's just a little bit of a, uh, I guess, little information on what the hell this is. So, uh, this is it right here. Let's go ahead and boot up the world. So as you can see, it's a regular world, and when you try to move, you can't really move because you're blocked in with this world border, as you can see, and it goes up all the way to the, all the way to the sky, as you can see, and um, yeah, so in order for this border to expand, you have to do certain things, including getting a bunch of different achievements. So as you can see, just opening up your inventory, you get an achievement, taking inventory, and as you can see, the border is getting a little bit larger, and you can't, yeah, you can't walk out of this. I'm trying to move forward, and I can't. And I think after a certain amount of time, you take damage, I think. I don't know. Whatever the case is now, with that being said, we can chop down some wood here, get another achievement, and I'm pretty sure this cow spawns in, and I believe it is stuck in here. I want to say it's stuck in here. But now, with this piece of wood we can make a crafting bench crafting table and the border will go out even more we'll get the benchmarking achievement go ahead chop down the rest of this tree and we can make a couple of other things that will give us achievements we can also look right here and you can see we can get time to strike um, time to farm. We can get a bunch of different things right here. So we'll go ahead and... Oh, we can't place things on here? Guess not. So let's go ahead and make a couple of different things real quick. We'll go ahead and make a pick. We'll make a hoe. We'll make a sword. And bam, right there. The border increases a pretty good amount. As you can see, we can go ahead and access this chest now. Which gives us some gold nuggets. 
some raw beef and some raw mutton and oh and that's also raw chicken i didn't even notice throws the same thing so i've also never played this before this is the first time i'm playing this and it looks like we get a chicken now too which is pretty nice we might be able to make a little chicken farm later on so i'm not too sure how long this will go on for i'm quite interested to see how long or how many things i can get done here uh Oh wow, what is that? Apparently if you hit tab, maybe it shows you, that shows you the amount of achievements you've gotten, I'm assuming. Alright, so let's take a look here. Turn wheat into bread. That's something we can do in a little bit. Harvest some leather. We'd have to get pretty lucky with that one. Getting an upgrade, that's probably the thing we can do right now. In hot topic, we could probably do. All right, so let's uh, let's see. Yeah, we'll go ahead and put this right here. What was that? Oh, it's another chicken. Yeah, we definitely have to make a little area for uh, these animals in a little bit. So as you can see, we can come down here now and start gathering some stone. There we go, we'll head back up here, make a better pick, because this one's a piece of garbage. There we go, and we get a pig! Alright! Not bad, not bad. Okay. Next thing we'll do is make a furnace. Which we will do... In just a second. I'm assuming if you head down here... You might find some iron. I don't know if this is just like a random world. Or they actually placed iron down here on purpose. I'm not too sure. But um, there's coal right here. Go ahead and grab some of that. We'll leave most of it. You guys probably can't see much right now. So let me go ahead and actually take a couple more. Just so we can light up this little area we have going here. This is nice. I've never played this before. So it's nice. Kind of playing something a little bit different. So, uh, pretty nice, because you have to be kind of creative on what achievements to get and whatnot. So, we'll put... Okay, I wanted to do that on purpose, because I'm pretty sure if you just place... I'm not even going to try it. But, I wanted to uh, break it, just in case I got a seed, and I did, from both of them. So, that's pretty good. All right, well, let's go ahead and see here. I'm going to go ahead and put... See, we're going to need water in a second. I'm not too sure. Oh, what's up, chicken? Sorry to uh, disappoint you guys. There's a rabbit over there, and there's another chest there and there. There's sugar cane right there, and we can access water, so... We might be better off just waiting... And placing down the crops close to the shoreline. There we go. Can we access this chest now? No. Alright. Uh, what can we do next? Smelt an iron ingot. So my question is. Can we actually find iron down here? That is my question. So, I'm going to continue mining down here. Um, like I said, I'm not too sure if you can get iron down here. I'm going to go ahead and assume. I'm going to go up real quick and... Oh, don't tell me I didn't get any saplings. Really? Oh, that sucks. Yeah, that kind of sucks. Well then. Let me go ahead and make... What was I going to make? Was it a shovel? I can't remember if I was going to make a shovel or not. I think so, right? Shovel? Yeah, okay. Well, that kind of stinks. I mean, I wanted to make a... Uh, maybe a chest, but that's not going to happen now. Whatever the case is, I'm assuming in a little bit we can get... A sapling from a chest, like I said, I don't know. Kind of just uh, guessing here. But I'm going to continue. I'm going to head down here and see if maybe I can find some ores so we can smelt some. 
stuff up and get a couple more achievements. So I'll be back with an update in a little bit. Alright guys, it looks like we have a cave down here. Which is pretty nice because we can get the... Which one is it? Time to strike? Yeah. I know we got that one already. It's a uh, monster hunter. This might be quite difficult because I'm on the 1.9 update and the skeletons shoot missiles at you. So I'm going to see what I can do here to try not to get destroyed. Uh, let's take a look. What up, guys? He has two hearts of damage just from that. All right, I'm going to head down here and I'm going to try to take out their feet. What's up, bro? Come on. Get over here. Let me see. I wish I made a better sword here, but this will do. There we go. As you can see, world border is going out a little bit. There's a couple of mobs out here still. Uh, I'm going to leave that for just a sec. Actually, let me put a couple of torches down because maybe they'll despawn when I leave here. Put one there. And another one right there. Okay, let's head back up real quick. And let's go ahead and take a look what's inside of that chest because now I'm pretty sure the world border has expanded enough to the point where I can open this. There we go. A regular potato. Obviously, that is a uh, poisonous potato and a piece of string. Nothing really useful. And I realized a little while ago I said I could. I wanted to make... Let's see, we got another cat too. I wanted to make... Or have some wood to make a chest. But as you can see, we could clearly have a couple chests here. So, we'll go ahead and put some of the stuff we don't need in here. Furnace. We'll put that right here. I feel like I've gotten a lot of achievements right now. Or in this episode already. But it's kind of been pretty short right now. So I want to continue on. Like I said, there's a good chance. Do I have any cooked food? I don't think so. No. But we do have some coal. So I'm going to wait. I'm not going to bother. I'm going to gather a couple pieces of coal, actually. Is that, oh, I saw iron for a second, but I'm blind. Alright, well, I don't know if the whole point of this is to get every achievement, or what? Yeah, there's iron right there, and this looks like a nice cave, so... You want some of this? You want some of this, guys? Hmm? Yeah, there's a lot of skeletons there. Let me go down like this. What's the issue? Oh, wow. These guys are having a party down here. Oh! Gotta take them out. Take them out. Alright, alright, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. I'm gonna get out of here. Because I don't want to die and have half of my stuff go flying through that little crevice. Alright, so I'm going to go cook up some food and make a better sword. And uh, we'll come back down there, gather some of that iron, and see if there's anything else down there. So, I'll be back once again in a little bit. Alright guys, I am back. And I just realized we can actually build up here. And there it looks like there's islands. I don't know. That looks like a snow island. A little bit of ice there. And that kind of looks like... From what I see now, kind of looks like netherrack up there, but I could be wrong. So, I don't know. There might be some good stuff up there, but... Let's take a look here. I don't know if these animals are going to come down here. Just in case they decide to, we'll just go ahead and block that off. For now, because I don't really want them coming down here. I'd prefer to keep those guys up there. And I might need to make a little hole in the ground just to keep them down there. Are these guys still down here? And these guys do not want to give up. All right. No one right there. This guy's going to spank me. Is he stuck on that water now? Yeah, looks like it. 
Oh. You missed. Let me eat again. Hello? He got me. Oh, he's gonna, gonna kill me! Ah, crap. Just my luck. Oh. Good move on my part. I had both picks on me. Alright, this guy has to be close to being dead, so I'm not too worried about it. But, he did get me. And I lost all my levels, even though it was only like three. Well, this guy still wants them, doesn't he? Yeah, that's right. Alright. This water is probably pretty important, so I'm going to go ahead and just block it off and keep it for later. I don't even think I can get to that water source. It doesn't look like it. Um, my question is, do I see anything crazy down here? There might be diamonds down there. I'm not too sure. What layer are we on? 34. So we definitely have a good amount to go if we're looking for diamonds. All right. So let's go ahead and gather up some of this iron. And I think this will probably be the last achievement we get today. And then we'll carry on next episode and try to get a bunch of other achievements. It's definitely going to be a lot slow. This is probably the most achievements we're going to get in one episode. Um, again, if you guys know if the objective of this is to get every achievement, feel free to let me know because, again, I have no idea. Alright, well. Get a piece of coal so we can cook this. Alright, let's go ahead and get out of here. Go ahead and just block that off. Let's head up here and just cook up some of this iron. And we'll go ahead and end off the episode. So, I don't know. I feel like we made a pretty good amount of progress here. In this first episode. Nice little start. Again, it's nice to uh, switch it up and play something different. Alright, we'll go ahead and put this stuff away. Put that pick in there, just in case I die again, which will probably happen. Alright, there we go. The world border expanded out another block. So we got, if I'm not mistaken, that's showing how many achievements we've gotten. So if I'm right about that, then we have gotten 10 achievements so far, which is pretty nice. So I can't really complain about that. It looks like we did get another chicken, it looks like. So that's great. But other than that, hopefully you guys did enjoy this first episode of this brand new mini series. I don't know how long this is going to go on for. Or, um,. How long it'll take me to get all of the achievements. But if that is the objective, feel free to tell me in the comments. But other than that, hopefully you guys did enjoy this episode. Um, yeah, it's nice to switch it up a little bit and play a custom... I'm, I'm going to call this a custom map, kind of. Custom uh, survival map. But other than that, if you guys enjoyed the episode, feel free to give the video a like. And uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. And I will see you guys next time.